These snails are Rhabdotus diobatus and they're tree snails in the Orthalicoidea superfamily, which includes members like Drymaeus, Orthalicus, and Liguus. You can find Rhabdotus on tall grasses, brick walls, and other man-made structures, unlike other tree snails which are restricted mostly to trees. Rhabdotus dilbatus has a large distribution, and it can be found in the southern United States from New Mexico east to Alabama and as far north as Missouri. The ones in this video are from northwestern Florida. Rhabdotus dilbatus has a 25 millimeter or 1 inch long shell, and it's always this faded tan whitish color, which is why their common name is the whitewashed Rhabdotus. They aren't picky eaters like other arboreal snails, and it's really easy to keep these in captivity. They'll eat pretty much all the same fruits and vegetables that other common garden snails do. The only thing that's a little bit of a challenge is raising them from eggs, because when they hatch, they're only a millimeter or two in length. So what I do is I isolate the hatchlings in a little Tupperware container and I feed them there until they grow up into a larger sub-adult and then I transfer them to a normal terrarium uh, because as juveniles they would crawl right through any sort of mesh screening you put on a normal terrarium.